Peace and blessings everyone. Welcome to the Humble Servant Homestead. Today we are right here before our cucumber Travis. Now I am telling you as far as the brush on here it is loaded. It is I mean it's, it's just full okay. It is full of greenery um, and also it is also full of cucumber and that is the reason why we plant these right here so we can come on in and harvest some cucumbers guys I am telling you we have been getting some nice shower of rain and that's why I said it is very important to make sure when your cucumber is starting to fruit you guys are watering them okay because um, that's what the cucumber is pretty much made up of is water so these plants need water okay with no further ado we're going to go ahead and get on down here and do a little bit of grocery shopping mm -hmm. okay we're going to go on in and harvest some of these cucumbers here now let me go ahead and take a knee because of course all the cucumbers they are down low um well, not all of them. Well, not all of them. The younger ones, well, not so much young. Right. But, uh, that's we do actually <laughs> got some big ones uh, right up in here, there. up yeah. top, but it's not ready just as yet. Right. We'll give it uh, maybe about another, another day, two here day too. or so. Mm -hmm. um, but none of the less, um, we're going to be harvesting ones um, that camera lady uh, like as far as sizes. Uh, we don't really like to harvest them too small, even though this right here is another a perfect day. size. Uh, we'll let it go ahead and fill out just a little bit more, um, but nonetheless, uh, right here we have a nice one. Let's go ahead and pull that. Beautiful. Now, look at that, guys. Now, this right here is the slicing variety cucumber, like I said. Um, I know I never did give you all the name of the cucumber that we have planted here. This right here is the market more. 76 variety cucumber okay so the more you pick the more these cucumbers will go ahead and produce and so that's why we went ahead with them here on the homestead now the variety that we actually planned uh we planted up top um would you like this one babe yes the variety that we actually planted up top um, um on the packet they said it was one variety <laughs> when we planted them uh simply it was not and we'll just so call it an unmarked variety pack yes. because it was about three different types of cucumbers. Mm. Was that a boar? Something yep. born in so there? Right here, guys. Uh, you wouldn't believe it because um, actually I haven't sprayed these cucumbers here, and so we do have. I uh, want to say some vine boar activity on these cucumbers here, um, but that's just the only one that I've found so far. Okay, and also while we're down here picking these cucumbers, another thing that you want to remember is you want to make sure you come on out and harvest your cucumber. Don't leave them on your plant till they get that light color or simply they're too ripe. Okay, now the reason why you don't want to do that with your cucumbers, uh, simply if you leave that cucumber on that plant and let it get that ripe, what will happen? Um, with that cucumber being so ripe, it will pretty much tell the plant that, hey, your job is done, so you don't have to uh, keep on producing more cucumbers. So it is very important to pick your cucumber when they are ready. Okay, now what we will do um, later on down, once we get enough harvest of these cucumbers, we will leave actually quite a bit of them on here to get ripened, uh, just to save for seeds, because of course, uh, we do like to save our seeds here on the homestead. Now look at this one. Now, well, when I say ripe, um, if I leave this on here any much longer, uh, as y'all can see, it's starting to change color. It would get too ripe, and that particular plant probably would go ahead and shut down. Okay, you wouldn't get much more cucumbers out of that plant. All right, so let's go ahead and keep this on one harvesting. at the bottom by your hand. Oh yes, I almost missed that one. That is a beauty. It looks like cucumber salad tonight. Oh yeah. With I mean, some cucumber ginger juice maybe. I, I take some juice too. Because uh, that juice is delicious. Alright. My 
My bowl is getting a bit heavy down here, guys. <laughs> guys also think about think about the trip that I saved from going to the store like I said right now we are grocery shopping and actually I have one more cucumber that looked like a vine borer might have gotten to it okay. and I'll show you what happened you can see the signs once they get in there and start eating on that cucumber think that is all uh, about it well no that is not it <laughs> actually we do have one more and see i said they're all not at the bottom yes and so that's that's all one also one of the things that we're going to have to make sure that we actually come on in and search high and low this uh i guess you call it canopy we'll come on in and search up in there simple reason why we don't want to lose any cucumber and here go another one <laughs> look at that now tell me guys if that right there is not a beautiful harvest of cucumber yes, now it is. Um, tell me if this right here don't look like it came from out the store pretty much that is what you would go to the store and buy okay mm -hmm. Um, so now with these market nice organic more, cucumbers. See again, baby. Nice organic cucumbers. Hey, that's it. You can't get it uh, no naturaler than that. <laughs> but nonetheless, uh, you think about it um, with these market more cucumber right here, you get anywhere between about eight inches to ten inches long. Now I believe if I'd leave these a little bit longer, uh, they probably would have get a little bit longer. A little fatter. Um, a little bit fatter as well. Uh, they do get fatter if they have enough water. They will get uh, swell up on you pretty big. Uh, but nonetheless, this one right here is what happened when a bug or vine borer gets inside of that cucumber. Um, this right here is just the gel from that cucumber. And what is this cucumber is trying to do, it's pretty much trying to protect itself. Okay? And so that's all that who's. As a matter of fact, Oh, let's crack it and see. Oh, there he is. And look at that right there, guys. Hold on, hold on. Let me get a good. He's angle. trying to go on in. Yeah. And so that right there is the culprit um, that come on in and try to damage this cucumber here. And had he not popped, look it, at oh, that. Look, he's trying oh, he's trying to, trying to escape. Come here, little sucker. There you go. Okay. I was gonna say, had he not broken that cucumber open, I I and just so, typically soak them in um. Some salt water and vinegar and um, they'll dig right out or swim right out rather and I still use the, the, the veggie that it bored into oh so, absolutely I mean, it's, it's um, still usable <laughs> like I said it's very little <laughs> go to waste here on the homestead uh, we, we don't want to be wasting food okay right. uh, not because the That's bug right cucumber, may have gotten so. inside of here that doesn't mean that this is still not edible okay because if you was in a situation where this all you have is this cucumber <laughs> i'm you sure you will make do way. yeah you may do with uh what so you that that would be much. what's going to go on with this one yes so guys um feel like we got at least about 15 pounds oh wow that's pretty heavy okay, okay. but nonetheless like i promised you guys and let you all know that hey we will take you all along with us on the harvest and so here we are today mm -hmm harvesting cucumbers okay but nonetheless guys i just want to say thanks to each and every one of you all out there for stopping by the humble servant homestead and as always peace and blessings to each and every one of you all out there now if you like the content you all got here today go ahead throw that thumbs up like share and subscribe especially share these videos guys get them on out there so that people can see what it is that they can do but one thing you have to put your mind to it mm -hmm. okay 
if you don't put your mind to it and then go ahead and put your hand to it guess what nothing will get done you have to be motivated okay um, what motivate me to come on out here every day um hey I need food to eat Hey. Okay, and also friends and family out there as well need food to eat as well. Um, of course, we do, um, you know, contribute some of these here and also sell some. All right, so nonetheless, guys, that is it right mm -hmm. there. I want you all to have a blessed day. Oh, that's heavy.